Whoa, this is the illusion with baby owl. We're on our first solo trip together. Mom said we had two hours to go do our own thing because we have never been on our little adventure together because I don't contain the magic stuff. So mom pumped a little breast milk for me so I can, uh, I can feed him if he gets hungry, if he so desires. And uh, I was like, I don't, what do I do on my very first mission with, with baby owl? I was like, I'm gonna take him out into nature. So we're at the, uh, the Zuma Canyon Trail and I figured I'd stop at this very nice sycamore tree and we'd, we'd just hang out and, and capture a moment in time together because uh, he seems captivated by nature, aren't you? The baby Bjorn, for those of you don't, who don't know, it is pretty awesome. So what do you think? What do you think about what's going on out here in nature? He's fired up. He's super pumped on what's going on, aren't you? Aren't you? You like the nature. He's just been staring up into the clouds and the whole thing. And he's super excited about it. I'm super excited about it because we got to go on our own little adventure. And here we are, we're out in the woods, hanging out, playing on a tree, playing on a tree. We're playing on a tree. We're playing on a tree, aren't we? What do you think? What would you tell them all at home about nature? It's beautiful, huh? It's beautiful, isn't it? He's super stoked. He doesn't even know what to make of it because he's out in nature. You know what the cool thing is, is I used to, I used to, my dad and mom used to take me out backpacking and stuff when I was a, a little guy myself. And so, uh, you know, I suppose it's like the family experience. We'll keep it on him versus me. You know, when I was, uh, gosh, man, all I remember is when I was a little kid going out into the nature with my dad and my mom, we'd go on these big, crazy backpacking trips. And my mom had even made me a little backpack so I could carry my teddy bear. So I had a little teddy bear backpack. And I used to, used to roam around. But the only thing I remember is, you know, because you're a little kid, right? You get tired all the time. And I would always be like, how much further? And my dad would always be up around the corner, up around the corner. And, you know, it was always up around the corner. Even when you got around the corner, there was a there was another corner. But uh, I don't know, man. I guess it's a family tradition. Thanks, mom and dad, for teaching me nature. Like, I directly credit my mom and dad with with turning me on to the beauty of nature. Like, I love being out in nature. It, it makes me super happy and super stoked. And you know, I got there via my mom and dad. So I guess I'm I'm passing the family legacy on to the little baby owl here and gonna teach him about nature too. He's just starting to look at things and really check them out. Like the whole walk out here, he was just staring off into just looking at the different shapes. I mean, for a child, it just must be just this intense menagerie of shapes, huh? Like, you don't even know what to make of it. Like, what, what's going on here? What is going on? So it's pretty exciting. This is uh, this is a breakthrough day. Like our first, this is our first solo adventure. Mom is at home with the mini gram making apricot bars. Like they're cooking together. And that's the thing, like it's on, it's on us right now. Like there's no, no fail safe anymore. Like, cause normally, you know, if he starts getting upset or something I can just give him to mommy and she can breastfeed him and that calms him down but as you can see he's a super mellow baby man like I don't know because I've never had a baby before but everyone tells me I'm super lucky because he's so mellow aren't I super lucky because I'm you're so mellow but he is he's just so mellow because you're a superhero he's a superhero by the way he's uh he is a full-blown superhero he turns frowns upside down. That's his, his main mission. But you know what he really likes? He really likes t-shirt logos. Don't you? Oh, look at that smile. Look at that smile. You like t-shirt logos. You like t-shirt logos. You like t-shirt logos. Logos. T-shirt logos. Yeah. 
so here we are man we're out in the out in the nature checking it out this is all new to him the funny thing is like we took our very first walk with him out here but he was gosh he couldn't have been more more than a month and he wasn't awake like he is now like he's fully like awake like checking it out like you're walking on a tree he's walking on a tree what do you think about that your feet are touching it you super excited about that he's so rad for all of you who don't know because now i've joined the daddy club it's pretty rad just to see an awake little human being that looks to you and it's just super pumped to see you like he's 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 super pumped he's super rad i'm fired up on baby out whoa i almost fell right there whoa because there's rocks and stuff aren't there you gotta be careful he doesn't i don't even think he knows what's all of that look at that look at that yeah anyway we thought we'd just let you join our adventure here out in the wilderness. Well, not really the wilderness. Zuma Canyon Trail, Malibu, California. Say bye, Al. Bye. Till the next episode.